Tell me again, why aren't you vegan? Chocolate. Cheese. Chicken. Aha, the big three. Why them? We, we like, like the taste. taste. But do you like the cruelty? It's cow's milk that makes traditional chocolate and cheese what they are. A cow doesn't just eat grass and milk magically appears. Like a human, she has to be made pregnant and deliver a baby. Nine months of feeling her little one growing inside her until finally, the magic of birth and motherhood. Well, perhaps not motherhood, as hours after birth, her baby is taken from her. Permanently. For tens of thousands of little male calves, it's a bullet in the head. More the slaughterhouse. For baby females who will eventually join the milking herd, it's solitary confinement for two months, for health reasons. No mothering, no company, no nurturing, just loneliness and incomprehension. For her, it's now ridiculous quantities of milk that she's been manipulated into producing and another pregnancy, both at the same time. With this excruciating man-made burden foisted upon her and a birth every year, year after year, her body simply can't cope and starts to break down. She'll die young, very young. For six months a year, all dairy cows live in sheds like this. Some spend their entire lives here and never go outside. It's called zero grazing. Now, about that chicken you like so much. Chickens like to live in flocks of about 12, not tens of thousands. Life's pretty tough from the start. He doesn't know it, but he's not just a little chick. He's a monstrosity, a freak of nature created by humans. From a few grams to two and a half kilograms in just 42 days. So rapid is their growth that their hearts often fail and their bones collapse under their own weight. These are the starvates who die because they can't get to food and water. When you eat chicken, you're consuming all this misery. So what about that taste thing? Believe me, vegans get plenty. Okay, now that you know a little more about the big three, what do you think? Be kind. Be vegan. Save lives.